Now I love Rome and Medieval 2 Total War, but the title that I actually have the most nostalgia for is actually Napoleon. I loved this game when I first got into the franchise. This was the best thing ever to me at the time. I wouldn't say I looked back on them with nostalgia glasses. I can still go back and play that to this day, as I do every day near enough, and enjoy it. But when it comes to Napoleon, I think I am looking back at it with nostalgia glasses. So yeah, this might not be as brilliant as I remember it. Anyway, I remember trying years and years ago now, because I've not played it in a while, playing Bavaria. And I got destroyed, like completely humiliated by the AI. It was a tough campaign. But now that I'm a super duper pro famous YouTuber in the Total War scene, I thought, you know what, I'll give it another go. I went researching online, uh, looking at some other people's Bavaria Let's Plays. About three of them that I saw, they all failed. None of them could do it. So that has me kind of worried right now. We're putting it on the hardest difficulty possible, and I want to test something. I can play Western Roman Empire in Attila on very hard difficulty. I've done it. But can I play Bavaria? Could it be that this faction here is actually the most difficult faction in all of Total War? Let's put it to the test. Alright, so the reason it is so tough is because, yeah, we got some quite big Austrian armies right here, led by some decent generals. They are at war with us. We are allied to France, but when I played it, I swear France went to war against me. So, yeah, it's sort of like enemies on all sides. Anyway, can we get any trade set up? Yeah, sure, let's try out Hessel first. And uh, you give me some money too. Uh, no, they're not interested. How about just 1k gold? Oh. Oh, um, how about just, uh, no, they're not that interested. Okay, maybe Saxony. Yeah, come on, maybe you. Come on, there we go. Now, I think that's all we can do for diplomacy. All right, basic settlement right here. I don't think... We're gonna get much out of these, to be honest. Uh, maybe, uh, I don't think it's worth it, because every YouTuber I see tries to defend Bavaria, but I don't think that's the way to play it. I think we've got to become a Napoleonic era Germanic horde. That is sort of the plan here. Does that get us anything? We've already got good infantry. All right, so let's get a general. Arthur, that's easier to pronounce, go for that. And, yeah, some cav. And, yeah, then get some line infantry. Sure, pile them up. Alright, now we don't have any school, so we can't research anything. That's about it, so let's give this a go. Come on, Austria, don't attack me. If they're pulling back, oh, they know. Super duper Melkor is in charge, don't they? Oh, yeah, they know it, okay. They're not attacking but they're attacking my economy. Right, same again, just recruit more infantry. That's all we need right now. Ah, what is this? They want a trade agreement, ooh. Join war against them. Sure, I'll do that, I don't think I'm trading with them. And they're willing to pay, I accept. Right, ooh, Austria, walking past, okay. They're abandoning that mountain settlement, good. I think I'll stay here for one more turn, and then I might go try and take that. Oh, they sabotaged my tax office. Right, I think it is worth repairing that. Oh, now we can train less. Poo. Alright, recruit them. I still don't see much point in getting this. What do we even get? A small upgrade on them. I'm more of a line infantry guy, rather than these Jager units. Uh, so I might hold off for now. Okay, Prussia has joined our enemies. Great. They've taken the other village. But overall, a couple of turns through, 
This is nowhere near as difficult as I remember. What happened in my campaign was, ah, oh, they came down to. Like, Austria instantly piled up their massive armies and just threw everything into Bavaria. And then France backstabbed me and they threw everything into me as well. It was a nightmare. But this... This isn't going all that bad. We got a nice period of peace. Which I like. Could actually... Maybe think about going for that and holding out in Bavaria instead. Nah. We've got to play it as a horde. No point just waiting and trying to survive for longer. We've got to expand to prove that we are worthy of calling this campaign complete. Ah, I guess I could mess around with taxes. Uh, yeah, make quite a bit of money out of that. Should have done that. Ah, well. Oh no, oh no, alright, it's time to dip. It's time to get out of here. <laughs> okay, yep, that big army there, plus them in reach. No chance we're surviving. Leave them behind, and let's march out of the settlement. I still want to try and hold on to this place. So yeah, get some troops out, see what we can do. Uh, no point improving the infrastructure. I expect Bavaria to fall. Uh, so let's expand down south. Shall we give the guys in here a general? Uh, nah, they don't, they don't need it. They're, they're all good. Army, push south. Alright, Innsbruck is now ours. Repair that, and I feel much more confident. Down here, we are safe. Should we? Ooh. 800 gold for 100 gold per turn. Is that worth it? Am I going to survive 8 turns? in Innsbruck. I'll give it one more turn first to see what they're going to do. Yeah, yeah, hold off for now. France, oh, here we go, they're coming in. Hopefully it's not to backstab me. Oh, okay, Austria pulling out. I expected this to be a nightmare campaign. Maybe, maybe it's not the super hard challenge I thought it was, but still, I want to give it a go. I enjoy Napoleon Total War. Ah, oh, Saxony. Uh, yeah, sure, call the allies in. Oh no, oh no. Is it gonna be the electorate of Hassel Nessel, whatever they're called, who brings me down? Of course it would be. Of course. <laughs> and after all that time, I was worrying about Austria. Speaking of Austria, they've taken Milan. And I saw the big, I think, I, I don't know whose side they were on, but I saw the big army down there. I need a spy. We could actually hold out here. I will get a general, I think. Johan, sure. Recruit him. Cancel those to bring some money in and start recruiting here. If we leave with this army, then yeah, they're unhappy, aren't they? Alright, turn off the taxes, that works. Okay, maybe stand here. Yeah, we should be okay there. I want to see what they're going to do. Do they have any armies down here? Oh no, coming in with reinforcements. But they're not attacking yet. We hold out for one more turn. Uh, you know what I could do? Would we be better off making them pay tax, but up here lowering the tax levels? Right, so we make 1,200 there. And if we do this, yeah, we make more by doing that. Alright, I see no armies down here, and Italy is back. Yeah, I saw the Italian army. Ah, that's it. They can, like, rise up with a massive stack. So I bet they revolted. Alright, let's try get some friendly relations going on. Trade? Nah, they're not interested. How about with the Swiss? Hey! Alright, so if Italy holds that, then I bet Venice could be pretty open. You know what? Close enough. Let's go for it. Alright, I'll have to fight this. I don't like the looks of those odds on this difficulty, but I think it should be an easy battle. Ah, shame about the terrain. I'm not too excited for this. Ugh. Like, there's no clear high ground spot for the cannons. Hmm. Now, it's been, I guess, apart from one stream I did, it's been years since I played a Napoleon battle, so... I don't know if I'm gonna be that good. I'm gonna put my cannons here, I think. We got a, a decent shot, so let's line them up. Start firing. Infantry, you start lining up. 
Cavalry, get on the far right flank here. Everybody run into position, although don't run in front of the cannons, please. I've had that annoyingly happen many times before, if I remember correctly. Yeah, keep shooting at them, and then we'll slowly move up with the infantry. Alright, they're completely off then. Yeah, they're willing to actually abandon the city at this point, it seems. Okay, pack up the cannons, and let's march into the city. Sure, we'll take that. If they're going to leave it open, we'll march in and take it. And then we should have the better terrain. Okay, I want you lot set up in the streets like this. Do we secure the building? Ah, uh, we've got too many men, so they'll be sticking out weirdly. Alright, best not then. Cavalry, go on the far right over here. Get ready. Cannons moving up too. General, you get round this way. Yeah, cannons should get in a good position. Infantry start to curve in a little bit. Start to surround them. I don't like that spot with the cannons, but we can make something of it. Okay, good. They're pulling out of the city even more. Just handing it over to us. Okay, in that case then, if they're going to come round that way, you set up like that. And you can set up like that. Cavalry, where are you? Yeah, keep getting round here, get behind them. I don't like this angle though. They'll have the clay high ground hit first. Shots fired. They've got sight. I do like this angle. Can they see too? Yeah. They're gonna start shooting now. Good. Oh, I love this time period. Alright, hopefully the cannons can get there quick. Alright, good. We're getting good shots in here. They have the high ground, but we're hitting them on the side, which is a big advantage. Yeah, close quarters like that too. Cavalry, yep, yeah, get right behind from now. Artillery, are you here? Near enough. Here we go. Alright, get your cannons set up. We're shooting from over here too. God, look at those lines. Boom, beautiful. Just beautiful. Alright, artillery. Almost ready. I've got a good shot. I don't think I need canister shot yet. What is the range on that? Yeah, don't go for that yet. Just keep shooting at them there. Alright, morale looking a bit shaky there for a second, but I think we're good. Can they actually see? Are they getting good shots in or... Nah. Do I push them forwards or are we okay? We're sort of shooting at them, but they've got a big advantage. I think, yeah, I think we need to start moving up a bit. Just to wipe out these squads here. Hey, there we go, the first break. Alright, now I want you two to push up there, and I want you two to start marching up the hill. Yeah, just to get a little closer to them. How are we looking on this side? Cannons? Yeah, they're doing okay. Okay, I want you two to march up and take out them. Okay, yeah, good. All should start firing on them soon. How are we looking over here? Come on, I want to break them soon so I can take this bit of high ground. Alright, there we go. Right, now push forwards and take the high ground. And I also want you to squeeze into the buildings here and lock down this route. There we go, much better to raid now. Aim and fire. Okay, good, we broke them. Let's zoom in here at the dead bodies, beautiful. Okay, now I want you to push over here and I want you to reinforce too. You're maybe getting a little too close, to be honest. So maybe you set up more like that. I'm a bit worried about the cannons, to be fair. Alright, maybe more like that then. There they should just be okay. Yeah, they should avoid the cannons there. Cannons, shoot at them. Alright, meanwhile over here, we're looking good on the front. The flank is secure. I think we now push the cav in a little bit. That's their general that's fleeing too, that's good. Alright, you two are now getting out of range, so push forwards. Try flank around them. Okay, good, they're breaking. You two march up. And you... Yeah, hold back a little bit. Avoid the cannons. Got to be careful of them. Alright, they're forming square at this point. My general's under attack. Nice, it seems good to me. Just some bullets skimming by. Alright, cavalry, run down these so they don't come back. Yeah, I'd like them gone. Good, the square's breaking. I'm good, we've completely destroyed them on the left here. Uh, Alright, you two fight them in melee, and I want you two to push up here, along with these two squads. Artillery, you've done good. You can stop firing now. 
Alright, good. We're routing them over here too. Yes, they're all breaking. Run them all down. General, you know what? You can start running them down too. All get into melee mode and cut them down. Whoa, General, careful there. That was my bad, bad direction. Come on, get out of there, pull back. Withdraw. Withdraw. Alright, I want you two to hold fire for a bit. Wait for him to leave the field. Well, not the field, but the scene. Okay, is he good? And fire, he's good. Ooh, that could have been bad. And with that, we got the win. Now run every single one of them down. Venice is ours. 3,671 kills and only 500 men lost. I'm happy with those results. The Cav is okay, the General's okay, everything's intact. And we will peacefully occupy, although that money we could kind of do with. Are we going up in money? We're going down apparently, which is not good. Can we get... Come on, Italy, I want you as a trading partner. We could do great things together. But no, nah, they're not interested. Sardinia, nah, let, let's try Mecklenburg. How about you? They're willing to. Now let's try Sardinia. Nah, they're not interested. Spain, perhaps? We are friendly with them. Good, we got Spain on board. Aye, Italy has no allies. So what I'm thinking is, maybe we could actually hit them instead. Yeah, take Milan. And we might be better off forming an Italian empire instead of a German one. Holding the south because we've got the Alps as a natural defence. I think that's going to be our strategy. Uh, anything we have to rebuild? Yeah, rebuild that. Everything else should be okay. Oh, imminent bankruptcy. That's, that's never a good sign. Uh, what do we do about that? Alright, so we're losing 602 gold here. So if I lower the taxes, then we're making more money. So in theory, let's remove all taxes. Nah, doesn't work. Alright, so this here is actually the best tax rate. If we pull it up, it doesn't really help us. And then when we go to maximum, it makes it worse. So yeah, maybe just hold it there, we might as well. I need some money. Just... 250 gold to survive another turn. Is anyone willing to give that? Hey, Spain, give me a thousand gold. Nah. Switzerland, become my ally for just a thousand gold. Yes, they did. Ah, oh, that's good then. We are saved. Ah, oh, they're coming with more troops. No, I do not surrender Munich. Looks like we're fighting it. They've got a cannon and two generals. I don't think there's much point holding out here. I'm done a fight anyway, but I think they'll just kill me with an Austrian army after I lose. Alright, so these guys here can place mines. Okay, sure, you place mines there. The rest of you pull back to the back of the map. Oh, ah, I'd like to hold the village, but if we can't put these inside the village, because we're not spawning here, then what really is the point? Yeah, we're better off defending the outskirts of it. Push them forwards a bit. Give it a while, let them get a little nearer. Okay, yep, yeah, shoot at them, tempt them closer. Tempt them to charge, and then form square. Yep, the square's holding out fine. We've got a backup square here. They are breaking through it, but we should be okay. There we go, they're pulling out of it now. Good, good. And good, the square held. That should be all of their cavalry gone. Oh wait, no, they've got... They've got more cav at the back. Right, here they come, they're coming back for more. Ah, oh, not at the time I wanted it to happen to. Now we're starting to engage in infantry combat. We've got troops all the way over here doing nothing. Not good, not good. Right. I want you to now take up their place instead. Ah, never mind. It's over. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna win it. Right, we got rid of the cav again. Try and get out of square. Ah, oh, they're fleeing. Ah, oh, it's not good. If we could have started in the village, well, the city, that might not have been so bad. Would have been able to hold down the streets and in the buildings, but yeah, sadly that's not gonna work for us. I think maybe try retreat into it, though. 
yeah, you pull back. Alright, now I don't know how this is meant to blow up. I, I'm not too familiar with this. I don't... Should it blow up when they stand on that? Don't know. It's weird. I don't get it. Oh, they're forming square formation here. I'm fine with that. Yeah, power right flank has fallen and it's all about to collapse. I'm just pulling back into the buildings at this point. See what damage I can do there. There's really no point sending bees into the buildings. They're not going to hold out. Slow down the enemy, weaken them a bit, get them a little tired. And then the real infantry will be holding down in here. There we go, look at the front line break. That's not good. I don't know why that never exploded. I don't know. Am I meant to trigger it myself? I don't know. Alright, how are we holding out here? This is my issue with Darth Mod. Like, you got... There's too many troops and it doesn't match it with the buildings, unfortunately. So then you got soldiers sticking out. Oh, well. But I do love this building feature, by the way. I wish it could return in, in at least some form, in newer Total Wars. I loved that feature. Alright, the first units in the first building here. Ah, we're getting decent kills. I think we're getting some, but I don't know how useful it's going to be for us. Especially when you've got units sticking out like this. Oh, those two are running inside. Hey, there's a spot, get me in there. <laughs> I'd much rather be in there than right here. I love how they smash open the windows too. We got some in the village. This is what I should have done at the start. But sadly we started, we couldn't get in so we couldn't use these defences. And I expected a big cav push. Oh well. Imagine if we'd had access to this and we set up a load of trenches in here. I bet we might have... Ah, I don't know if we'd have won it but we'd have done much better anyway. Meanwhile I'm sending these two guys on the flank. They've broken once already. But I'm wondering... Could I perhaps take out their cannons? Probably not, we can't form square formation with them. It, and their morale is terrible, so the Cav will probably take them out, but it's worth a try. Or maybe eventually try kill their general. That would be good too. Alright, they're in now. They're about to get into the building. Come on, hold. General, get more over here. Just to help out with their morale. Keep them holding. They're dead anyway, so the longer they hold, the better. Just keep it going. They're coming round this side as well now. Come on soldiers, hold out, hold out. This is for your homeland. Come on, do something. <laughs> oh, what are they doing? No, you're meant to be firing back. Alright, me line them up, that might help. What's going on over here? We're actually holding out quite well so far there. Alright, they're back in formation now. Can they actually start shooting? Come on, don't bug on me. And it appears not, but... Oh well, oh well. <laughs> oh, yes, their general here. Come on, just charge. On these, come on. Run, there we go, we got one, two. Come on, just charge. We might be able to kill him right here. He's thinking about it. Come on, this could be a massive help. If he just charges a little further forwards. Ah, oh, he's not doing anything. I'll keep an eye on that. How's it looking over here? Alright, form up a line there. Start shooting at their calf. We might be able to get to the artillery, but I doubt it. They're still there. Meanwhile, on the front... Alright, another blow off the trumpet, I think. And then, yeah, get the general out of there now. Pull him back. We're holding out in the buildings, though, for now. Oh, he charged through, took some losses, but survived. Someone got an upgrade here. That was weird. <laughs> I forgot how buggy it is. I didn't notice that when I was much younger. Rotate around. Play ring around for roses. Enemy general killed. We got him. Don't know how. I think someone must have shot him. Oh, well done to whoever did that. Good job. Right, General, yep, yeah, keep rotating round. Keep trying to survive. How's it looking over here, the charge does? Alright, fight them in melee. See what you can do. Probably nothing. Come on, if we can break the calf, we can take out the cannons. 
That should help us in future. Alright, never mind. We've lost it. Oh, if Aircalf is actually willing to chase me down there, then maybe we charge these in melee. Oh, that blew up. Good. Alright, at least get them out of the battle. No, they're in the charging and maybe bring them back up over here. That could be fun. Uh, how's it looking over here on this side? We've lost it. One building left untouched. All the infantry's broken. General, get round this way. Pull back again. One last blow off a trumpet. Come on, General, get out of there. Oh, he's fallen. I was going to try to take out the cannons with him. Oh, well. We put up a good stand, I think. We killed... Oh, I thought I was on top for a second uh, All right, we only killed 1,300. It wasn't great, but we were expected to lose that battle anyway. All right, there we go. Bavaria has fallen. Oh, we've got an agent. Do we have a school for him, though? I don't think we do in Venice. Alright, so just have him act as a spy for now. No Austrians coming, so that's good. And set off with my army. And what is the quickest route here? Right, get onto this bridge. Are the people happy? Yeah, close enough. And we can even afford to push taxes up a little bit. So yeah, go for that as well. Come on, Napoleon, like, your enemies with this guy. Kill him. Kill him and then hand it back to me. That would be perfect. Oh, nope, never mind, do nothing. Pull back instead. I swear, this AI used to be so much better. Like, this is truly for me, looking back with nostalgia glasses. It's not as good as I remember it being. Ah, oh, Italy, of course you would. Get in an alliance with Switzerland. Uh, can you break that by any chance, Switzerland? Uh, I'll pay you my entire 284 gold. Nah. Okay, how about at the very least, you can walk in my lands for 20 turns, I'll walk in yours for 5 turns. They accept. Okay, now this way, we can get through to the Pope who is allied with Italy, and that's how we drag Italy into the war. Yes, we'll go for that. <laughs> ah, we got a spy too, ooh. I've got a good use for him. Spy on the Italians. Yes. Now, we're not making much money because our port is blockaded by the Austrians. So let's quickly kick them out of there, and maybe stay in there for now. Uh, we can't afford to repair it. Come on, France. you got to help us out here. Please. To war with the Papal States. Italy joined them. Good. Uh, it's about evenly matched, isn't it? I should be able to win this. Better terrain, I think. Yeah, I definitely prefer this. Alright, uh, so they're setting up on the left. Uh, we got... Yes, yeah, so we got some nice flat land here for our cannons. So get them set up right here on the front. We'll try to take out their general or something. Okay, meanwhile, the rest of the army should be okay just forming a very standard line. One big long line with the infantry, and let's just mash them up a bit with the cannons. Maybe, shall we aim for their artillery? I think we should. Or maybe go for the cavalry instead. Yeah, I think if you hit for cav with artillery, then they're tempted to just straight on charge for your cannons. Uh, but we've got to get some infantry facing this way just to help out. Oh no, maybe it's going to be a bit too close here. We don't want them to actually hit us. Alright, good, good, good. There we go, we should be okay. There we go, we broke them. Come on, you can take these cav out, take out them too. Good, we got them routing, come on. Alright, meanwhile, our cavalry start pushing this way. We can take out their artillery. Alright, their infantry's coming from that side, so start to curve in the line a little bit. Here we go, big battle beginning in the middle of the map. Cannons, try your canister shot, see what you can do with that. Infantry, start to... March in a bit better. 
You do the same. How's it looking on this side? We should be okay here. As long as we can keep the cannons, oh yeah, they're already routing there. Perfect. Right, now hopefully we can get these routing too. Yep, cannons, close quarters, canister shot, that's all you need. Good, the infantry running to the front here too. Just rotate round, make sure you get a good angle. Good, we're breaking them. Right, you push a little further forwards. You two squads draw help out. This squad here, you set up like that. Good, they're entering our little slaughter pit here. How's it looking over here? Wait, we are struggling a bit on this side. You know what? Withdraw a little bit. There we go, they're routing now, good. Alright, you infantry march up to help out with them. This squad here getting a little bit too battered for my liking. Uh, go back to normal cannon shot mode and try to take out their cav at the back. I'd love to run these guys down for the experience, but my cav are here and there's too many of these around. So I've got to be careful. Oh, we've had a retreat. Yep, thought it would be over here. Uh, we're doing okay over here. That squad got battered, but the others, they're hanging on. Good, now that squad's broken, charging with them. And now we can start pushing in to take the village, I think. Well, I call it a village. It's actually the mighty city of Rome. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's a village here. Oh, what? Oh, they had a calf charge in my back. I did not see that. Oh, now you tell me. Yeah, thanks. All right. You form square. Ah, oh, this side's not looking too good. We were looking good until that happened. All right, cannons, you're needed here now. Ah, oh, it's... They're completely surrounded their artillery uh, with these things here. So try and get the calf right to the back. All right, what's the issue here? All right, yeah, they're running. Alright, I think, flee this entire front, get out of here, we can bring reinforcements from this side when we need to, just defend the cannons with them and that's all we need to do, come on, have these not broken yet, come on, how are you missing your shots from there, there we go, these three squads now, pull back, try and flip them over onto this side I think, They've got their Hussars there. I don't want to charge that then. Yeah, i got to be careful. What's happening here? Another squad breaking? Oh, they shouldn't be breaking there. Right, luckily i got troops coming round. Alright, they've come back to the battlefield. You know what? Bring them round here. They can help out with the cannons. Charge them now. Good. We can get them on both flanks. Avoiding the little traps. Alright, yeah. You get in there. We should sandwich them and defeat them. You start coming round this way. Yep, it's looking good. There we go. They're breaking now. Looking good. Looking good. Alright, they've engaged us in melee here. Come on, can we somehow maybe get a shot in on their general? Yeah, cannons, maybe you try shooting at him again. Alright, how is the cav looking? We should break from here. Yeah, we quadruple them in numbers now. Should be an easy win. Okay, good reinforcements finally arriving on this side of the field. You know what, set them up here, and then you can pull back and set up there. Can you even reach? Oh, you two can't even reach them. Alright, push forwards a bit then. Oh, we're still breaking, the new squad is breaking. Who are these line infantry here? They're taking out everybody at this point. Ah, come on soldiers, we got two more units here, hopefully that should be enough to tip the balance. I should really use my general more, but this should be an easy win, especially after that big break in the middle. But apparently not. Alright, I think we should be able to charge them safely. And then, as for here, they've got their general. It's a cav unit, so I think I'm better off actually forming square for now. Hopefully they don't do the same here. Otherwise, that could get a bit messy for my calf. Come on, get in there, charge them. Get them off the field. Oh, good, they're finally breaking over there. Finally. There we go, we hit them. We should take them out now. Is their general charging me yet? No, but it will do eventually. I'm sure of it. Actually, I might have to pull out of here. Yeah, pull them back a bit. Because there's more infantry coming. Here we go now, I think... We're getting close to the final push. 
Yeah, I got the cavalry around. We've defeated them on this side. All the infantry is now marching forwards. Somehow their general is still alive, despite all the artillery bombardment that's been thrown on him. Uh, which has been a bit annoying. There we go, we broke them. All right, now charge the infantry in. You've done well. You can have a bit of a rest. Charging in melee. Cannons, you stop firing. And now let's sort of like execute their general here. Where is he? He's one of these. So here we go, take him out one at a time. Come on soldiers, you can do better than this. There we go, he's broken. Someone kill him, oh he's getting dragged along, poor guy. I do like Napoleon visually though, I think visually to this day I think it still holds up. Like, I can't think of any big issue with it on the visual side. There we go, we finished off their artillery. That was a brutal battle. But yeah, it is a beautiful game. It's like if they made Napoleon 2, but a, like a much more up-to-date campaign, but the battles are basically the same visually, I would accept this as a new modern Total War. I'd be fine with it. Look at those kills there. Good, and with that we take Rome, and the Romans are pretty miserable about it. There we go, just remove taxes. Oh, we're facing bankruptcy again. Uh, maybe, do we have to pay taxes? I don't want to, but I might, might have to bring him down to the school. Uh, we can't, can we get any research? Ah, there we go. Yeah, start working on, I don't know, go for that. There we go, Portugal will pay 500 gold for trade, and uh, it's still not looking good, but it will accept it. Still not looking good financially, but it gets even worse. The Italians are attacking us here in Venice. That's not good. Can I actually probably sneak in there now and, uh, yeah, I could actually. Alright, let's take back from Bavaria. There we go, we're back home. How is finances looking? And we're going up in money too. Okay, now I would love to go up and take out Italy. Deal with them. But we are at war with Naples. And they have two very big stacks. And I want some more time to recover before I do anything. So, to be honest, I am a little bit worried right now. Oh, now you come, France. Now you come. I thank you for finally arriving. Oh, alright, that's a lot of Prussians there. Am I even at war with Prussia? I don't... Yeah, I am. Alright, I, I need one piece. Just one piece treat it on one front and I'll be happy. Naples, maybe. Come on. No. I think I'm better off withdrawing, pulling back to Innsbruck. I guess get another unit, sure. And they might reinforce Venice. Oh, I'm struggling too much financially though. Alright, get him in that there. So he can start getting some tech for us. Oh no, Prussia's coming. Okay. I don't know what they were doing there. Are they going for Innsbruck instead? Oh no. That could be really bad if they take Innsbruck. Ah, uh, we, we gotta go and deal with these Italians. And I can't do it with this army, because I've got to worry about these guys instead. Naples. And we're still a bit battered too. Two turns left until we starve out. Great. Oh no. Oh no. The Prussians are here. I I refuse to surrender. Why? Because they're going to hold out for one turn. It is possible that the French army could march down here. Oh, just leave me alone, Naples. Please. But the French could march down and possibly, hopefully, help me out. And we've hit bankruptcy. Ah, great. Alright, well, anyway, I think we've got to try fight this here. Uh, okay, we'll give it a go. No harm comes from trying. Apart from the death of about one to 2,000 men here. Alright, luckily we do have a town here. So get set up in the buildings, I think, and have them come to us. Now, we don't have to necessarily win it. As long as we kill enough, 
we should actually be okay. Especially if we can get the cav gone. So the first shots are being fired, they've got cavalry on the flank. Alright, get into square formation. They've got cav over there, but they're pulling back. Alright, good. Yes, get into a good square here. That should deal with that squad. Good. Okay, I want you to push forwards a little. Focus on that, not at shooting or you'll get friendly fire. Alright, take out the cav. That should be step one. If we can do that, I'll be happy. We just need enough so that Venice might someday hold. Okay, good. They're pulling out. They know it was a mistake. Alright. There's the other hostiles. They've got line infantry there. We're getting our shots in. Good. Keep it up. Keep it up. Okay, form another square. And I want you two to pull out now. Yeah, just avoid their cav. Yeah, let this square here do it instead. Let that deal with them. They're shooting us here, but we're in the building. We should be okay. Come on, get them cav out of here. All right. Now, form back into the line formation. Luckily, we got this building here as well holding out for us. That should get a load of extra kills. Oh, come on, soldiers. You need to get into the line. Ah, oh, we lost our general, did we? And here comes another wave of cav. Get everyone back in square formation, then. Hold out in the buildings. Uh, you might have to probably try and... Ah, uh, is there any point retreating now? Nah. I think maybe try flank around with that squad. Ah, uh, never mind, that didn't go as planned. Okay, we're fighting it in melee now. As for these guys here, ah, uh, they just got guns down. Couldn't do anything against that cavalry-infantry combination. We're still in here, though. Ah, oh, we're getting massacred in here, too. Well, there we go, we're all retreating. We're holding out in that building at least. Uh, I'm trying to get into this one here, but... With some retreating soldiers, but no, we just got cut down there. Like, maybe you try getting to that building at least. Nah, they broke. They've broken, and it's down to these. I doubt they're gonna change the tide of the battle. I think they're done. But we did what we had to do. We had to throw a load of men in there just to try and weaken them enough. Hopefully, it should work. Hopefully, France will take out Prussia, and then hopefully, we can do... We can pull off a miracle in Rome. Alright, we retreated to there, that's okay. Yeah, spend a turn replenishing, and we'll see what we can do next. Oh, this surrenders... I think we surrender next turn then. And we're bankrupt too. I think, despite our best efforts, we might have lost the campaign. It was a tricky campaign. Not tricky in the way I thought it would be. I expected Austria to just throw everything in on me, like how I remember it when I was younger, and repeatedly failing at the same challenge. So, it was interesting that it's different. I'm a bit disappointed that it's different. I was, yeah, maybe I remember it wrong. I don't know. But still, I think we did quite well. We made it down as far as Rome. Just, ah, we just didn't have the luck on our side near the end. And France is not helping out too. Prussia bringing in reinforcements. Yep, we've lost that. No point even fighting it. And same again there. To be honest, I think if, if Italy did not fall and remained an ally, I think we might have won this. Because I'd have been able to use all three settlements and France to hold out against that Prussia push, but... Nah, I think it's all over at this point. Look at all the disastrous news coming through. Wait, I've lost all my trade? Oh no. Why is that? I don't think I've got any safe trade routes, that's why. So it all got broke. Hardly anyone's trading with me anymore. How's money looking still going down? I think I lost this. I think that's a defeat because I can't even afford new soldiers, really. So I think I'm dead at this point. Is it, however, the hardest campaign ever, like I was looking for? I'm gonna say nah. Because if we had a bit of luck on our side and Italy was still an ally, I think we could have won the campaign. So I'm not gonna say it's Western Roman Empire in Attila level difficulty. 
I'm not going to say that or even the Russians are here to celebrate my downfall too. Wonderful. There goes Venice. But still, I'd say it's a pretty tough campaign. Auto resolve that, yeah. Like, even if I survived, they've got another 20 stack to the south, and to the north, an Italian 20 stack. I, I don't see any coming back from this. I think we've lost it. Alright, now this is more what I'm familiar with. Austria and France both hating me, about to just eat me, right here. This is how I remember this campaign. Might as well give it one more turn, just to see if they actually kill me. I'd like to see a big battle with France where they try and defend me, but I doubt that's going to happen. I doubt we're going to see a massive epic finale battle here. Yeah, I think if Austria pushes for it, France might just pull back. Alright, oh, Napoleon's here versus Karl von Osterreich and Andries Hoffer. Do I do an AI only battle? Ah, go on then. Welcome to an AI only battle, and today I am going to be putting Napoleon's skills to the test. How good is the Napoleon AI? Let's find out. Oh, we can actually defend at least a bit of the village this time. Okay, now it's not the best defensive formation, but we got some little trenches set up with uh, uh, with uh, militia here and our good units. They're in the buildings. Uh, hopefully we can hold. Here comes Napoleon's hot air balloon. I don't know what happened with the map. It disappeared for some reason. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what happened. Well, anyway, here comes Napoleon with his uh, cavalry here. Well, that is a massive Austrian army right there. I assure you've got it in you, Napoleon. Uh, cannon's already firing. Well, at least that's a good sign, although not even formed up yet. Could be a bit of a problem. Where even is Napoleon? Oh, they're trying to get out of there. They're trying to flee. <laughs> oh, why does it look like they're desperate to retreat? Oh, that's not a promising sign. Uh, ah, here he is, here he is. All the way right at the back. Hmm, you can't see much of what's going on from here. Ah, oh, nah. Right, we got some infantry coming in for to help us out. That's nice. Now, AI, I'm just gonna stand here. You do whatever it is you've got to do. Oh, we're getting bombarded by the artillery already. That's okay, though. Let them bombard my militia. Give the French time to get onto the field. The first gunshots are going off by my men. Can they hold for long enough, giving Napoleon and his troops enough time to arrive? He doesn't have that many men when I look at it. I swear he had a full 20 stack. Alright, here we go, they got in here with their calf. I think some got stuck on the spikes, maybe. Well, they're all getting stuck between, like, the trenches and stuff, aren't they, so... Yeah, they're not doing much. Oh, what are the French doing? Come on, France. Form up a line. Oh, no. Where, what are they doing here with their infantry? Oh, this stupid AI. It's certainly not at all how I remember it. I remember it being so much better than this. Oh, Napoleon Total War. Why do you have to disappoint me like this? Uh, they're already breaking into the first building. Alright, they're pushing up with their infantry. What are they trying to even do though? Trying to get them in the back here perhaps? I guess it could work. I'm trying to hold down these little choke points, but I don't think it's going to be enough. You're going to have to rotate a little bit now. Anyone going to help me out on the right flank here? We can actually wipe out their right flank if, you know, you put some effort into it. Nope, never mind. I think it's got too much cav. More infantry coming in. They don't look like they want to be here, though. Ah, oh, we've broken. That's not good. God, that sounds awful. <laughs> they had, oh, a bit of a push over here, but... Oh, they're not using the cannons right. Their cav has broken. What are you doing, France? Oh. Yeah, they're not helping at all here. They're fighting it terribly. Like... 
they'd actually be doing better if they just abandoned me, formed up a neat line in the corner, got the cannons firing too. They could do so much more just like that, but they're piling into the streets. Their AI doesn't know how to fight in these conditions and they're just getting massacred one squad at a time. Although balance of power is actually looking pretty favourable right now for some reason, I... I don't know why. Yeah, if I break in here, I don't think it's like 66% chance we win this. I'm not seeing that right now. Alright, we've lost completely on the right flank, losing a squad of cannons. That's not good. Alright, we've broken them on this side. Well done, France, on the right. Uh, still not looking too good. Uh, but overall, my troops are actually holding out quite well in the centre. Alright, we might actually be able to turn this around if France can work up and actually get here. Alright, and here we go, we've defeated them on this side too, the right flank. Uh, get my troops back into the streets then, or maybe try to go around for the cannons. Yeah, with the once broken troops, that might be better. Meanwhile, actually in the streets, it's... It's again, it's not looking too bad, there's a lot of dead Austrians right here. I don't know how they all died like this. And not many dead troops of mine, like this was a squad of 500. They lost a lot more than I did. I bet it was this building here shooting at them in the back. Wow, I'm actually really impressed with how we've held out here. I thought we were doomed, but no, we've done well. Alright, well, here's their general too. He's now getting shot at from the building, don't know where he's planning on going. Uh, splitting into two different groups it seems, he's going to now get shot by those guys. Avoiding that trap there. Right, he's going to try help out over here, but I don't think he's going to do much with it. Yeah, we're still holding down most of the buildings here. Right, they finally broke us here, but those troops fought really well. Fighting to the death there. On this side... Uh, you know what, I think we can bring these troops round here, rotate them to face that way. And over here, yeah, just keep shooting at them. Ah, oh, we're breaking over here, I don't think we're going to make it to the cannons. Yeah, we broke. Oh well. Balance of power, very even right now. And enemy general wounded. Alright, that's one down, another one to go. Ah, oh, my general's being killed. Alright, infantry. Yeah, sure, if you've got a shot there, go for it. Bring the reinforcements in. Oh, wait a minute. They can only have 20 stacks of troops in at a time. Which means half the army is only just arriving. Oh, yeah, we're doomed. We're doomed. I thought that was it. I thought that was everything, but no. Their reinforcements hadn't even arrived yet. Oh, poo, we're, we're doomed. Well, at least we wiped out the first army, okay, but this second one is... Yeah, just gonna walk right over us and clean up the mess here. Militia, we've finally made it round here. Now, take out their cannons. Oh, allied general wounded Napoleon has been taken off the field. Well, at least we took out the cannons, though. Alright, now try to get round this way and take out the final cannon piece. How's it looking in the city? There's hardly anyone left. I'm still in the buildings. That's about it. I've got some reserve troops here. Uh, try reform back behind the trenches. But I doubt we're going to be able to do much. What unit is this here? Bravely holding them back. Well done French soldiers there, but... After that breaks, I think that's it. This is Napoleon's bodyguard. I don't know what he was thinking. Don't worry, Napoleon, I'll win it for you. They've got all their artillery here, and I've finally made it round. Get your guns ready, soldiers, and fire before they fire at you. Oh, some artillery hit nearby. Come on, shoot them. Hey, here we go, bullets coming through. All right, they're done a fire. You know what, I think we're better in melee. Silence the artillery now. Just charging at it. Yeah, before they fire canister shots at us. Because that cannon, it, it's aiming at us. Come on. Got to take it out quick. Alright, there we go. We've engaged. Can we take them out? We lost the building. Well, it's about time. 
just wiping out the artillery. And he went flying. <laughs> there we go. We got rid of all of them. Good. All right. Back to the centre. Wow, it's a miracle that building held out for that long, though. We're still holding out here to and in all the other buildings. You know what, given our numbers, what we had, and the fact we're relying heavily on the AI, I'm quite happy with the performance of my troops here. They've done really well in this battle. And no more Austrian reinforcements coming in, so I'm assuming everything we see now is it. Balance of power is ticking in our favour, even though we're routing all over the place. Take out these. If you can do that, we might be able to win it. Ah, oh, we lost another building. We're still in two more though. Holding on here. Now, take out these. You can do it, infantry. Ah, oh, never mind. They broke. Well, they fought well. Yeah, they were being shot at from the side too. Oh, they're coming back. They want some more. <laughs> They've done so well, this squad here. Taking out their entire artillery and a couple of infantry units too. Very good for militia. Can they take out the Jaeger units of Austria? Nah. Ah oh well. But you know, we've also got to give credit over here. Oh, we're out of ammunition, aren't we? Ah, well, we still might as well hold the building. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Ammunition. That's what we ran out of at the end of the day. The troops need help over here. Take out this square. Balance of power is not fully against us. They're coming back for even more. I love to see the morale here. Beautiful. You've got to give credit to them. The 8th Regiment of Militia. You've got to give them the credit they deserve. Oh, you're breaking. You're no 8th Regiment. You're only the 6th Regiment. Boo. <laughs> oh, we've got one unit left over here. They've still got some gunpowder left there. Come on, just hold on a little bit longer. Up there on your balcony. Take them out. Oh, what does France even have left at this point? Two cannons. That's it, but balance of power is still 50-50 apparently. I don't know why, it must really value cannons. The cannons are actually doing quite okay so far at holding them back. Because they're only shooting back, they're not charging. So that's good. Shouldn't have opened my big mouth. <laughs> Alright, well, there goes France, I cannot believe it. France, starting back here, died before me, starting actually on the front line. I was only meant to slow down the Austrians, not hold them back as I did, I'm impressed with that. But there we go, final squad has broken. And with that, we lost. Look at the kills there. Oof, we got to see these in more detail, so these are my troops. Considering by how much we were outnumbered, and that these 500 ones here are militia, they actually did really well. Like, militia getting 100 kills plus is really good. Then we got the, the line infantry here as well, in the buildings, getting 324 kills there. I'm happy with that. The performance of my troops there. They did well. But still, we lost Munich and therefore the game. Welp, there you have it. It is a very difficult campaign. Even though I lost, it's easier than I thought it would be. If I had a little bit more luck in Italy with the Italians themselves, maybe staying as an ally, which in most games should have happened, then I think I could have survived in Italy, eventually wiped out Naples, and then have had quite a good army and economic base to expand outwards. So it's not impossible, by the way, I think it crashed. Yeah. Oh well. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. I don't plan to do more Napoleon. Might try the Great War mod, but yeah, I still... For nostalgia, I want it to come back and give it one more go. Subscribe for more, share with anyone you think may be interested. But for now, until the next one, Mel gone.